Hello and welcome to DAP. My name is Veena Prashant. In this video, I'll take you behind the scenes to show you how you can install DAP. All right, so let's get started. So first thing you need to do is log into your WordPress dashboard, go to the settings page, and there make sure that your WordPress address and your site address are both set to HTTPS. Make sure it's not HTTP, uh, but it's set to HTTPS and save settings. So the next thing you need to do is log into your members area on our site. And here under the download tab, you're going to find the DAP Easy Installer plugin. So click to download. It will download the plugin to your desktop. And then go to the license key tab and click on uh, this button here to get your license key for DAP. And copy this somewhere because you're going to need this uh, when you use the Easy Installer and also when you try to access the DAP dashboard for the first time, you'll have to enter your license key to get started. All right, so next thing you need to do is go to plugins, add new, add the Easy Installer plugin and activate it like any other WordPress plugin. So after you install and activate the DAP Easy Installer plugin, go to settings and click on DAP Easy Installer. It will bring up a page like this. Initially, when you go to this page, it will just show you the DAP license key field and you will have to enter your license key here and save license and then this page will open up and it will show you the other settings. All right, so here just follow the steps to complete the installation. So go to step number two. Here you can select the version of DAP that you want to install and click on the one click install button. All right, done. DAP has been uploaded to your site and then move on to step number three. Here it will allow you to install one more plugin, the DAP Live Links plugin, which you also need to run DAP. So go ahead and install that as well. That's done. And uh, that's it. So step number four is cron installation. You don't have to do it right away, but be sure to set this up. Now, if you are not sure how to do this, you can always open a support ticket and we'll help you with this. Otherwise, uh, you just have to enter this command uh, in your web hosting cPanel under the advanced cron job section. But if you are not sure, you can just open a support ticket and we'll help you with this. All right, so this is my hosting cPanel and let me quickly show you where you can set up the cron. So you will find a section called advanced. Typically it's under the advanced section. It might be under a different section, but look for cron jobs and click on that. So here select once every hour and then enter the cron command that you got from the easy installer and go ahead and save it. After you upload the files, go to plugins and here look for DAP Live Links plugin and activate it. All right, so DAP installation is now complete and you can access DAP by clicking on the DAP link that you see right here. So this is the DAP dashboard. And uh, what I recommend is if you're new to DAP, then you can use the DAP setup wizard to get started with DAP. It will help you quickly set up your membership site. So you can access it uh, under the dashboard menu. You will find setup wizard, click on it and it will bring up a page like this. It's really easy to use. You can set up one or more products using uh, the setup wizard. You can set up your payment information. You can create member facing pages such as login page, content page, profile page. It will help you with all of that. And to just follow the steps and it's really easy to use. And once you're done with this, you can always update whatever you set up using the setup wizard. So you're not going to be stuck if you enter uh, some information here, you can always update it. Uh, whatever you set up here can be updated later. All right. So I hope this was helpful. My name is Veena Prashant. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.